Well, hello there, and welcome to Empire 2 Total War. We are now in the midst. We've been betrayed. We've been betrayed by the pesky Indians and the pesky Indian faces and their Indian culture. But as retribution, we took Kashmir. And then we also took, oh God, Rajputana. Rajputana in Udaipur. Uh, Udaipur sounds easier for me to say. So we've taken two uh, settlements. The one that we need is this one up here, Hindustan. It's one of our victory conditions. We've actually got six more territories than we need. We're doing rather well, but we've got to get this war finished. And then we've got to betray our friends, the Ottomans, but that'll all come in time. Um, so we've got some Indians walking around our, ter our territory. And that's all, all nice and well. But we sort of had to stop at the end of the last episode and put um, Nagpur in Bera, no, Bera, the city in Nagpur. We put it under siege with our elite and most fantastic army. And now we're going to kill all these people. They're all infantry apart from some Mughal light cavalry. Which are some sort of range, mounted mar I wonder if they're going to be cavalry archers again. And then we're going to be moving another army up. These chaps, what we're learning very quickly is without experience, they run away. We don't really like them. So we're going to hopefully sort of phase them out of the, uh, the military. I am also trying... A filter out on the microphone. It doesn't seem to spike as much. I think it's limited. It just stops it getting. I don't know. I don't know. I couldn't work out. I'm not a very technical man, and I don't edit my videos, so I just put them up and say, "Oh, sorry about that one." But anyway. We're off to kill some Indians. We've got our elite forces. It's going to be marvellous. Got some cannon. Look at that. We've got very bumpy ground here in India. Well, someone should really do some landscape gardening and sort it out. But these chaps don't run. Well, that's the plan. I mean, they might run. But hopefully they won't. And in true Empire 2 tradition, when we start the battle, they're going to be bloody miles away. We need like a hill. I think if we pop you there, because don't forget, they got in, these have got insane range, so we'll set them up once we've walked past them. Start deployment, my love. Here we go. They're all sort of, we'll just, we'll just do this. Now, can you fire? Where's your red line of limits? Oh my god, they can reach all the way down the map. These are huge. We don't want you to fire just yet. Because um, I suspect I've put... Yeah, that would have been carnage. So when we've all marched a little bit out of our way, and we're down in the dip of the valley, we're going to open up fire with the artillery batteries and have some jolly good fun. This is a key moment for us. And even though we were, if you didn't catch last episode, even though we were planning to betray the Mughal Empire, they attacked us for reasons best known to themselves. So, this war is their fault. 
I, I claim no response. I probably need to not do this on time six. And you could all do. Look at that! Look at the cannons! That's their general there on the horse, just running behind their lines. Oh, we're going to get a good volley here. Load, Mardis, load. Got some Arab infantry. It's very loud in these battles. I think it adds something to it, though. I'm quite chuffed with the way it's gone. bloody Islamic swordsmen and they get inside the line here come the cavalry charge mighty horses of the Persian Empire Ninety six, ninety two. Now there is a unit. Oh, they just got creamed. We kind of need to get over here with our horses. Take out their general. That's what we're after. Oh, these are the chaps that lie on the floor. They're just poo. Just pile in on their general. Look at that. Look at that. seem to use their lances very well in combat, do they? That's their general dead. We'll probably take these out now. Our units is severely weakened. Two of our units, look at that, he's got, he's been promoted.
I'll make a box of doom. Oh no, they've, they've routed one of my units. Because I wasn't paying attention. I need the cavalry to get over here. To charge at them. Volunteer swordsmen. Let's see how they do against guns. Not very well. Here come the horse. Save the edge of our line. That's where we're going, boys. Charge! Got some archers left now. No, they're both retreating. It's just this one unit of archers. Oh, we are firing on our own horses there. That's probably not too wise. Probably not that confident when they've seen this happening. They got the little swords out. Oh, that fella at the front's got his bow ready. Wonder if we can hit them with our cat with our cannon. I mean, they're, they're not even wearing shirts. Oh. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Just the front row of, the, of that arch unit exploded. <laughs> No matter how many times, I still find it funny. Now, what have we got? No building. We've lost a unit. That's a shame. Doing some retraining.
Ah, that's a good that's a good thing to realise. I think we can now upgrade some Yes. Whoever can build cannon, we can upgrade you now. One, two, five. Six, seven, eight, nine. We could do with one more, and then that fleet will be complete. Don't want another admiral. Oh, I've done it again. It's that one. Six. Plus four makes ten. Learn your number bonds, children. It helps in warfare. Right. So we have, we can't, we're going to slowly up, upgrade all of the um, ordnance factories as well as we're going through this. That's a problem, though, that we're going to... The fact that we lost one, that's a bit of a shame. Um, can anyone build those units? I don't think we can. No, we're hampered by... Well, they'll be fine, I suppose. They did all right. It's just those bloody Islamic swords. When they get into your line, and then they just... Even the most experienced and badass troops I've got, they just make them rout. And there were some people left. We need those... Those technologies for sort of health and casualty recovery. That's going to be key. Oh, he's off on his march back to the school. He's going up to north. And we don't need to kill them. What we, what we would like to do, very much so, is sort of stop at Hindustan, as it's one of our victory conditions. I just think it's so annoying when they when you take it to settlement and they just spend their time. Oh, hang on. So you're nearly retrained. That's fine. Did you give me any suppression or? No. There's no point building that yet, is there? We'll try. Oh, you can. Hello. Can you build Persian? Firangi, Numa, Bark, and Daz. 1929. What's that in relation? 1927. Oh, so they're better than our standard Persian line infantry. Yeah, we want to destroy that. We've got another agent. It's another rake. Let's just send him off to do mischief in the north. So seven turns and that army's going to be ready. I mean, they're not even blockading our trade here. Otherwise, it'd have a little pirate flag. So he's now linking up with the army inside Ahmedabad. just kind of want 
Malwa and Hindustan, and then we'll we'll be happy for a bit. You can all be retrained as well. I suspect over here we've actually got we've got two, and we need ten. And there's ten slots, so we can just click away like madmen. There we are. Next. Five turns and that army's ready to go. Is there anyone else that can build cannon? You could. You can't. You could. Oh, you're one of the ones that's on no taxes because we've just taken you. So it's just these two. Once we've got these two, it looks pretty damn positive. You're just going to run around and destroy our, our towns and we can't do anything about it. Bit of a shame. I mean, if they... They sue for peace now. Which I can't imagine they will do. But if they did... We can... We've got like a Battle of the Bold situation where we've just got a blob. So we've got a bit more cash coming in as well. Oh, they destroyed my mines. That's a bit upsetting. Ah, oh, there's been a rebellion. I don't care about that. Is that what you're going to tell me? There's been an enemy raid. In the Pleasure Gardens. That's what she calls it. You're almost certainly going to rebel. There's nothing we can do about it. We don't worry. Rajputana. That's the one we knew about. We have to just rebuild that as well. There should be one knocking around here. They're so well camouflaged, that's the problem. Um, there you go. We'll destroy that next go. So we've got our rakes now sort of ready to start. No, that's mine. No. <laughs> Don't want to destroy my own buildings. I always think they work better when you have um, when you actually get inside them first. Giggity. But it's true. Like here. I don't think he's going... Oh, no. See? So just go inside. Lay low for a while. We would very much like you to be... Yeah, I think magistrate. They're most they're very helpful most of the time. You can build a ordnance factory. So can you. You can't. You can't. 
I run out of money. But we want a region as well. If we're going to do it, we'd like that one. No, they're not ready. They've only got four territories left. It's gone rather well. I mean, well, the reason that we did Persia, I think it was first suggested by Mr. McGroin because he thought it would be... And I think it, when I did a playthrough on Empire 1, and it was a real slog. But actually the way that the nations work, they behave like they actually should. Which seems to have worked in my favour. We'll put down the rebellion. And then we'll retrain all of Yao. Kashmir's had its own rebellion now. We don't fight our own rebellions. We just auto them. So you're going to have to go back there. I think we've reached a point where we can't actually go anywhere. Who's dead? Is that one of my ministers? Oh my god, my treasury's gone. Try him. No, he's pants. No, he's okay. Now he's a bit better. We'll leave him for a bit. Someone else is it's just rebellions everywhere. Look at this. quite get there yet. So we'll go for Malwa next go. Right, can you destroy it now? No point upgrading the towns just yet because they'll just raid them. And I'll just keep losing money when I want to be making more money. That's the whole point of the game. We've got three turns to wait. You're nearly back. I absolutely hate it when you spawn gentlemen or scholars. Nowhere near the actual research towns. Hate it with a passion.
So I think... Oh, there's another rake. So I just don't... I just can't see them. <laughs> They're like ninjas. But I think we're doing... I mean, we're going to hopefully attack Malwa. Got no choice. These are our weaker units as well, so I'm not expecting big things from them. We've just got to be a bit more. I think I'm going to split the cavalry this time because we've got to stop these swordsmen from getting on there round the edges and then they charge down the line. Um. So that's going to be my... Oh, we've got a fantastic hill to defend. Oh, I like the look of this. We do that. Uh, we instantly set you up. Because don't forget, we're on the defensive now. So we're just going to defend the hill. We don't want the lines too thin because these are all prone to running away anyway. They're absolute. I think I did an episode where they were where the title was literally cowards, which is pretty much what I think of these orange chaps. I'm gonna put you two down here, and you two can cover this side. General just sort of sit about. Generals are useless. You'll on defend. Super stuff. And now we're on the opposite side of the long walk into battle so i just have to see what is that medium archers light cavalry we've taken a lovely defensive position i'm very pleased with myself i often compare myself to wellington <laughs> oh we're just cutting through them there is a real destructive power to the artillery in Empire 2. It does feel quite nice. When you're not on the receiving end of it. Oh, they got their reinforcements as well. I didn't necessarily think of that. I was just thinking maybe I should have run here, but there's only one building. There's not many fences. Everybody knows how much I love a fence. That's the general. They're sending the general in first. That's just mental. they waiting for the reinforcements to get here? So if they are, that's quite... It's quite an 
aggressive option. It feels like we outflank them, so... We could do with... Almost shuffling across, couldn't we? No, that's silly. We should just do it. Everybody shuffle. Quick, 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 quick. Fire as soon as you're ready, boys. locals this is what we have to be wary of they get them round your line and it cocks everything up for you to take a volley then. Come on, crack. Crack for me. Uh, what's that? More armed locals. Come. What was that? Something just exploded all the way. What is it? Don't break. Three things have broken. Canister shot. Fire at them. Just fire at this. center has just been destroyed. Oh, and shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. He's right there. He's right there. Oh, this will be hilarious.
Oh, it didn't work as I wanted. Something is definitely sort of... It's this. Backing... Uh, it's back in line. What is it? Is it, is it these? No, the whole army's broken now. It appears it's going to be slightly more challenging to take over India. We need to get rid of these armies and replace them with the elite forces, don't we? That's, that's what needs to happen. We need everyone to get back as well and reform our line. Quick, defend the hill. Back onto normal shot. That doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh dear. Well, that's going to be a defeat. Close defeat indeed, but a defeat nonetheless problems so maybe mm. well he's dead where do you think you're going ah that's such a shame Got to run away to the coast. What we need is like some peace time so we can replace all the armies. That's what we shall be doing. So we'll keep some just for policing purposes, like you're fine. This army, in fact, we'll get rid of you. Oh God, that was loud. You've lost, um, I know, you need to go, oh, can we tax you? Yes, we can, that's good news. We'll have a military hospital. You're not really needed, are you? So... We're going to disband you as well. We're going to have better troops. A more professional army. Well, can you recruit something in here? Is 
so we'll just replace you. We'll put I have a general. Four of them. Twelve pounder artillery. How much better are you? 1933, 1929. But we did say in the last one that they're better than what we've got. So we can re recruit a, an upgraded army in Punjab. Who else is not being taxed? That's probably helpful if we now put some effort into the economy for once. Can you be taxed? Yes, you can. Another mighty 409. My word. Oh, but with Lita and Armour and out to 32 grand. So now we've got a shorter border. Who else can build those decent? Can we build them in Afghanistan? Mm, no. So what we're going to do is basically flood India with our better units. We could do the rubbish. Who's rubbish? Are you? You're an elite unit. You're not mine. In Punjab, we got rid of you. Got rid of you as well. Hmm. We're going to have to have a bit of a reset. I've just realised, 50 minutes, because we've had two battles. And all of their forces are in the west now. Calcutta and this other one on the coast. Kuttak. There's no one here at all. I mean, look at that. Absolutely no one. Can we tax you now? Yes, we can. fine now 32 grand that'll tick in over nicely was it just that one port that could be re well upgraded not repaired Charge bonus of 20, melee defense 11. I 
Oh no, we don't want to do that. We want to... Why can't you build... Oh no, we do want to then. We want to wait until we can get some actual cannon out. Right, we're going to have to leave it there. A cessation of hostilities, but it was it's necessary, really. Once we've got the new territory stable, we're going to have we're still aiming for Hindustan. <laughs> we still haven't got there. We've got every other territory that we need, but apart from the one that we actually wanted. So it's ticking over. It's going okay. We just need. I think Kashmir and Punjab are going to be a bit of a bugger to try and hold. So that's why we need to get men out into the field straight away. I also think it might be wise. I mean, do we need this army? They're rubbish. Although they're better. Oh, that's an interesting thing. 1933. Are those colonial chaps better than my Persian infantry? 1927, yeah, they're not very accurate. We need to get rid of all of them. But chipping away. We just need four territories now, I think. We need Hindustan, we need Armenia, we need Turkey itself, Anatolia. And we need Syria, Damascus. And then we're done. And then because we're so early on, it might be wise just to see if we can conquer the world or how far we can go. But we'll, we'll have a think about it. You're returning home in shame. Absolute shame. But you need a peace. The whole point of war is to get a peace. So I'm I'm confident with my decision. We'll leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. If indeed you have, do take care of yourselves and goodbye for now.